What's going on everybody? Welcome back to GMI's World and I've been getting a lot of questions about what's going to be coming with phase two of Most Feared and I want to let you guys understand there are certain people that went through the whole set for Ray Lewis got back the three cards and used that to trade it in for bats. Now the way that it is right now we're going to go ahead and take a look at it currently to kind of see what the prices are. You're going to probably like around 600 700k you're going to spend. All right, that guy's 245. All right, um, they, they've come down a lot, 245, 240, okay, so right there. All right, so you're looking at like 490, um, and then uh, 245, so everybody's 245, so 490, you're gonna be looking at like 700 and something, and then you can sell Ray Lewis if you don't want him. Now, remember, Ray Lewis is like 400 and something K, so a lot of you guys are trying to figure like, should I take that loss to be able to quick sell the other cards to get the bats? Because remember, even when you put it up for 400k, EA is taking their imaginary tax. So you still got to pay extra. You're not going to get back as much. Is it worth the gamble? Are the bats going to be that important? I don't really know. I don't feel comfortable saying that because we've seen this before in other promos dating back last year that it didn't turn out to be like the value of snow. It just didn't turn out to be what we thought it was going to be. So I don't know if that's something that we should all like, you know, just dive into because right now even with ray lewis being one of the top middle look he's down to 373 so you got to understand if you're doing this right now it's pretty much dirt cheap with the way these prices are and it might benefit you a little bit more to just play the solos get all the free stuff play the house rules and try to get as much out of it as you can because if you go another route with it you're gonna probably lose now remember when i did the harvest last year for lawrence taylor he maintained the value of his card People are realizing that when you look at Ray Lewis's card, that zone coverage, bro, I'm telling you now, I understand people want to run around and use Ray Lewis and all that stuff, you want to use him, but realistically speaking, you shouldn't have to. If you're running a nickel package and you want to have him in there and you want to you know, bring down Pat Tillman, you should have that option of putting one of the best middle linebackers in the history of the NFL in the coverage. You shouldn't feel like scared, like knowing, all right, they see Ray Lewis, we're about to doubt him. Like, you shouldn't have that fear, but unfortunately, that's what happens. And pretty much, I've played against several Ray Lewises, and I just throw the ball right at them. Like, whatever I'm doing, wh whatever it is, and he just stands there, for the most part. Now, I've played Ray Lewis with Enforcer, and he's knocked my block off, okay? So, he definitely hits like he has a knife in his hand. I mean, um, he, he hits very hard in Madden. Like, forget about, you know, no, he ain't do nothing. Let's just go back to what we are talking about. So... Pretty much right now with the way that that's being set up with phase two now with all new players, what are we supposed to be doing? Well, that's pretty much a no brainer. You're gonna come over here and you're gonna start playing the most fair challenges. Now, many of us, including myself, um, last week I was more focused on weekend league. So I didn't really have time to really get a lot of these solos done, but there are a lot of things that you guys should be doing. Okay, so pretty much with the, with the whole situation, what is, oh, I forgot about doing these also. You get 10 attempts per day or whatever, but does it still give you the stuff? I don't I don't know, hold on, but each team, each team gets one drive score TD on each. Oh, so this just stays there and you just keep, you know, getting the reward over and over again and it just stays complete? Cause I've never low key redone it. And I thought because I had the check mark on it that it was just done. Let's go check this out a second because I think that people were talking about this on Twitter, but I was more focused on getting the other solos done to get the free 85 overall and just get as many bats as possible because all of the things that happened with like all of the uh, free training and everything I took a chance on a lot of those other packs and just converted them into bats but again I want all of us to keep a suitable amount of training because as the better cards come out you're gonna still need to fall back on that many of you guys just got training and you never even did anything in the game God bless you guys but again it is what it is it doesn't really matter you guys have to make sure that you're still prepared to do it now with this right here, what do I have to do? Because it's on competitive mode. Hold on. What do we have to do now? We have to score a touchdown. Do not let your opponent score a touchdown. All right. So we're gonna. it's on competitive mode. So that means we can throw picks. So we're going to go to our favorite formation. All right. Um, he's off a little bit. I don't like that I'm right here. I don't like... I should probably run the ball low key. Like it would be realistic, but I'm just going to throw it anyway. And then throw a pick. You caught it? This is competitive mode though. What? 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 Why? Okay. All right. I'll take it. All right. Low key. All right. Let me call a timeout. Let me call a timeout. I, oh, we don't have any timeouts. All right. I'm just going to run it and get tackled immediately then. Yeah, because you know, I didn't want to dive. I wanted to stretch, but whatever. It doesn't matter. All right. So now 
what we're gonna do is this. All right, we, we did run in pack trips. All right, so let's just, we gotta really run standard defense. Because, um, oh, I didn't even, I didn't do what I was supposed to do. Get, get it back there, okay. All right, let me, see. don't throw a touchdown. Please don't throw a touchdown. He's gonna throw a touchdown. All right, so that, oh my God. And I gotta replay the challenge. That that was that was outrageous. I'm gonna tell you why that was outrageous because I completely forgot to put my um set my defense to base and it threw everything off. Even after I mossed this guy completely, that was wild. I, oh my goodness, I got stuck on Willis too. All right, just go, just run, run, run. All right, you should be good. That should be a touchdown. All right, let's go. All right, let me get focused now. Let me get focused. I don't know what's going on, but the computer will cheat you wildly and uh, do whatever you want. Plus, also, why did they let me go for two? Why do they want us to go for two? Is there a bonus for going for two? Like when I did this before, I don't even remember what I was doing, but um, I don't know if there's a bonus to go for two. Cause like, why would they be putting us out for two point conversions? That's what I was supposed to do the first time. Now what I'll do is when you set your defense up, like when I'm running three, four, like I like to have my auto alignment as base and you'll see why, cause everybody is set where I want them. So it's not that big of a deal. You know what I'm saying? Like everybody just stays where they're supposed to be. Bro, why did my camera keep doing that? So now, you know, I'll get somebody to scream like that and then they'll fumble and do that. But if I don't have it on base, I really can't do all that stuff. So it kind of, it kind of gets crazy. That's pretty much why you guys just saw what just happened. Cause I was just all out of whack talking to you guys, but that's really what happens. All right, so we got the five. Oh, we only get three? All right, let's return to the challenges. We only get three, really. And some of you guys were saying you were doing this like multiple times over and over again. That's kind of lit, bro. I like that. Let me know what you guys have been pulling if it's still working. I don't know if EA might try to nerf you guys up a little bit. Um, but okay, so what do we get for the first one? Bats, of course. All right, what's the second one? Bats, of course. Like, just give it to me. Yep, bats. And then what's the third one? More bats? Bats again? Bro, bat it up then. Oh, perception. Nice, nice. Okay, so you guys can keep doing that over and over again, even though it has a check mark. I just showed you. I don't know how many times they let you do it, but this is something that I wanted to really, uh, you know, make you guys, you know, point out everything. With these right here, after you get that team captain token, obviously most of us already have that. I think it's worth it to get that 85 overall nat, simply because. Hear me out. You don't have to open it, but just get it. Just have. Just, hold on. Wait a minute. Why is that? Was that? Is that one I already did? Hold on. Wait a minute. Did I just go on the top one and I'm doing this again? All right, we gotta get out of this. We gotta go back to the um the thing. It looks like I had five stars at the top. So I don't wanna keep redoing the same thing. I was supposed to scroll down a little bit. But you can see that you can probably get some value out of the 85 overall net. With the way that the with the way that they're doing everything and how the sets are and the way that they don't have the players going into sets and you're having to you know get crafting materials and all that other stuff, it does make it rather ridiculous. Rush for 50 yards, passport. Yeah, I did this one already. Didn't I do this one already? All right, let's go back to the, um, what is that? Ghouls just want to have fun? I think I already did this one. I think I saw the five stars at the top. So let me just go back and just make sure. I don't want to waste uh, waste time doing the same thing over. But like I said, because I had to do Weekend League, and now I got to try to get the rest of my wins for the other pack, it's better to focus on making sure you get these done before phase two, just in case. Yeah, there it goes. What, what they try to do is they make, hold up. Do not allow more than three completions. Recover one fumble. Do not allow more 40 yards. Okay, we got to recover one fumble. That means we're going to have to run and uh, celebrate and then let, the, let them hit us and we'll fumble it because trying to make the CPU fumble is a nightmare unless it's on um, arcade mode. But like I was saying, with phase two, more than likely they're going to give us more options to get a free player, more options of getting more solos, more free coins, whatever, however they decide to do it. Are the players going to be better? I don't know, but that's we don't worry about that too much. Just make sure that you have the stars already done in case they add it onto this. And then say they give you a tear like a hundred stars, you get something else. You know what I'm saying? Like that's something that I'm more concerned about that we should probably focus on to make sure that we have what's necessary for it. Um, all right, so what do we need to do? Um, bam. Okay, we got we got the base back. All right. Okay, let's bring this guy down right here. All right, let me, let me see what he's doing. Okay, why did I get stuck on page, man? All right, fumble the ball. Okay, he didn't fumble. All right, good. It's saw arcade mode, but he didn't fumble. All right, cool, cool, cool. Oh, it's arcade mode. Oh, we good, we good. They're gonna fumble the ball. All right, that's fine. That's fine, I just saw it. We just gotta line him up with a nice hit stick and everything's gonna be all right, so let's do that. Whoever gets the ball, we gotta just come in with hit sticks. Wildin', bro. All right, he's not gonna fumble, obviously. Um, We have to figure this out. I think I'm just gonna celebrate and recover the fumble that way. And then we'll just go from there, to be honest. Because it doesn't make any sense to do anything else. 
Why is this guy? Okay, he's already. If we can get a fumble right here, I'll be good. What? What? Bro, what? They had. The, okay, they're gonna punt right now. Okay, so do we have to get? We, it's just for that drive, right? That we can't allow those completions and stuff. So if I celebrate right here, and they hit me, I should fumble. So let me let me see. All right, right here. And then he doesn't fumble, of course. Of course he doesn't fumble. So then you, you, you know what I'm saying, bro? Like, of course. So what do we get, four? All right, so do not allow, we have to recover one fumble. So it looks like basically we just have to make, I didn't realize the way it was set up. We just have to, we gotta make Cam Newton fumble real quick. That's all we really have to do. We gotta hit stick this idiot. That, that, that's pretty much it, we should be good. All right, get in there. Okay, if, if they don't let me line it up for the hit, it doesn't matter, like, okay, yeah, they're still showing the stuff in the last one. All right, that's fine. We just have to be able to hit stick this guy one one good time. And this is what you guys need to be doing, bro, like. All right, don't, don't. Oh my God, man. Oh God, I just need, I just need my player to line up one hit stick, bro. Like, just let me get one hit stick on this idiot right here. Just one hit stick, that's it. Let me get one hit stick. And this dude, is, he's coughing that up. There we go. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Okay, there we go. Good job. All right, run it for 6-2. Pick his mom's up. Have sex. Okay. I'm about to say have sexual relations with it, but that one's over. So, like I said, some of them can be like that and be mad, wild, whatever. Just get them done, and then as as we go on, they're going to probably give us, like, you know, some more sneak peeks into what's going to be going on. But for now, I would recommend getting those solos done, getting that 85 overall player, turning that player into bats, unless you want to do something else with it in exchange to get a higher overall elite. That's what I that's what I'm gonna do with mine. Um, whatever you guys decide to do, that's on you. But again, getting these extra bats, getting these things like that, I think that it's gonna make it a lot easier for you if they turn out to give us some players that are really, really most feared that we really, really want. We'll have an upper hand on it because we'll already have this done. So when they put out new milestones, we'll be good to go with it. You know what I'm saying? It'll be more stuff here. Um, that'll probably come down with the different tiers and they give us more opportunity to get more players But at this point, I don't really see any use for bets because all the players like I don't want a Cam Newton I, I don't want none of that foolishness. You know what I'm saying? So I'm good with that um, Just waiting to see what it is I would love for you guys to tell me who you want you guys told me before for phase one what you wanted now for part two What it, what is the player that you're looking for because obviously EA Sports don't even care dog like they just put out some straight garbage players. Who is this? Clay Matthews? All right, he ended up solo. All right, so we're good for now. All right, so once they release more information about the free players, all the solos, everything like that, you know where to be at. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. Stay tuned. Turn on post notifications. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitch. And I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. One love, y'all.